1947, my job was taking pictures for the agency in Washington. Trinity, Crossroads, I was there. I've seen a lot of strange things, but nothing could have prepared me for what I saw that hot day in July. Sergeant, get those to Washington on the double. Yes, sir! Corporal. Now, son, I want you to understand, this is a matter of national security. Who knows what'll happen if the world gets wind of this? That's why what I'm gonna say to you now is the most important thing you'll hear for the rest of your life. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? Yes, sir. You were never here. The military was not here. Do you understand? If anybody ever asks you what happened, you don't know. Your job was to take pictures, not ask questions. Nothing happened here today. If your wife asks you, nothing happened here today. If your kids ask you, if your mother asks you, nothing happened here today. If the friggin' President of the United States asks you, nothing happened here today. What do you guys have here? Just shut up and take the pictures. want to see me again, son. Because if you do, it'll mean that you remembered what you were supposed to forget. And they'll be picking your bones out of the desert. Get him out of here. The army didn't know what they had. It literally had fallen in their laps. And those flyboys weren't about to share the knowledge with anybody. We started down the hall and he said, bring him back, I'm not through with him. And he came up and he started patting me right here. And he said, Buster, you don't go into Roth and start a lot of rumors because nothing's happened out here. I remember him saying that, hell, he was part of the cover-up. And this was all on the secret. No one was to know anything about it. Colonel Blanchard kept this all under wraps. Concerning Roswell, I have no doubt in my mind that something happened. A lot of these things that were done were done pretty much in complete secrecy. You've got to keep in mind it was the only atomic bomb group in the world that located here at that time. In those days, uh, loose lips sank ships. We didn't talk about it between ourselves. It was just, it was that, he was that emphatic about not talking about this. So uh, I just put it out of mind, forgot about it. It didn't happen. I was told it didn't happen, so it didn't happen. The longer it goes without us knowing, the more difficult it is for the government agencies to admit that they've been lying for all these years.